Today in Zoe at the Movies, a conversation with Storm Reed. Your father has accomplished something extraordinary. Also dangerous. He's trapped by a darkness that's actively spreading throughout the universe. And the only one who can stop it is you. Hi, Storm. Welcome to Zoe at the Movies. It's a Hi. pleasure to meet you. Yes, nice to meet you, too. How would you explain the concept of A Wrinkle in Time for those who didn't read the book? Yes, well, A Wrinkle in Time is basically about a young girl who has to go through the universe to save her father, but through uh, the journey, she kind of saves herself and kind of realizes that she is special and that she is beautiful, and she basically saves the world, so. That's basically a wrinkle in time, and she has three beautiful guides to be able to help her, and she goes with her little brother, Charles Wallace, and her best friend, Calvin. Was it hard to change to different emotions as the movie went on? Yes and no. I feel like emotionally, if you're going from happy to sad, in one scene it can be kind of challenging and tiring, but I feel like Meg was so relatable and I basically just had to step in her shoes and become her. So it, it, was, it was fun and challenging and stressful at the same time. <laughs> how was your relationship with your dad and Charles Wallace, and how did these relationships intertwine? Yes, well, I, I feel like they're all connected and all intertwined because they are father and, and daughter and, and son and brother and sister, and they all connect. But I feel like Meg kind of puts herself out there and kind of risks her life for both of them, and she does that with love and vulnerability and her faults and her challenges, and they all kind of connect in the same way, and she's basically able to save both of them. So through that, I feel like it just shows the really the love and the power between a father and a daughter and a father and a son and a sibling relationship. <laughs> So, how was it working with Oprah, Reese, and Mindy? Oh, it was so much fun working with Miss Oprah and Miss Reese and Miss Mindy, and they were just like family, and they became family to me. And they're all so grounded and so gracious and so humble, so to be able to share a screen with them and also learn from them and have fun with them was really great. A lot of people follow your career, so mm -hmm. how do you interact with them on social media, like Instagram? Yes, well, I, I um, try to stay active on Instagram, and I just try to put positive messages out there on my Instagram, so if you're having a bad day, I want people to be able to come to my page and feel empowered and feel like they are worthy enough to love themselves, because they are. And I just try to interact with my fans and, and kind of relate to them as much as possible and kind of share a piece of me. You have a very strong career at a very young age, mm -hmm. so what advice would you give to aspiring actors? I, I would just tell them to um, make sure they stay in acting classes and to make sure they're good people and they study really hard and try to perfect their craft. But I think I would say that to everybody and whoever is trying to achieve their dreams, they can do anything they want to do and they shouldn't let anyone stop them or tell them different. Be a warrior. Thank you. Thank you.